This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Friday, January 6th. We now know the third ship that Carnival Corporation is offloading. During a quarterly business update last month, Carnival Corporation announced that three of its ships would be leaving the fleet this year, including two from Costa Cruises. Now the company has announced the third ship, which is going to be the Aeda Aura from the German brand Aeda Cruises. The 2003 built ship is one of Aeda's most well-traveled vessels, having sailed over 800 voyages since her debut, including a world cruise in 2018 and 2019. For her final season before departing the fleet in September, the ship will operate sailings in South Africa and in Northern and Western Europe. And after its two-day dry dock with guests still on board, Queen Victoria has departed Navantia Shipyard in Cadiz, Spain on Wednesday. The vessel had to enter dry dock unexpectedly to replace a blade on one of its Azipod propellers. During the ship's time in dry dock, guests were able to take advantage of the 24-hour shuttle bus service into Cadiz. Queen Victoria has been on a 15-day Christmas and New Year's cruise out of Southampton. She's scheduled to arrive back in England tomorrow. And finally, two MSC cruise ships departed Genoa, Italy on Thursday for world cruises. In fact, this is the first time two ships from one cruise line have ever departed on a world cruise from the same port on the same day. MSC Poesia and Magnifica will sail together for the beginning of their 117 and 119 day voyages, then part ways once they leave the Mediterranean. Throughout the cruise, award-winning chefs will board the ships to meet guests and showcase the best of their cuisines. The World Cruises will also feature over 30 full-scale production shows, dance classes, language... Okay, this is just fluff. And cruise line stocks were up on Thursday. Carnival Corporation up 2.4%, 8.94. Royal Caribbean up 1.4%, 53.37. And Norwegian up 2.7%, 12.79. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Do you have a story or a tip to report? Let us know. Email tips at cruiseradio.net.